John, a fantastic point. Is it a result you'd have taken before the game? Yeah, it's a very difficult place to come. Um, we knew it was, uh, it was going to be awkward. There's a few things to contend with there. One, they're, they're a good side. Two, there's a slope. Today there was the wind and the sun, so there was a few things that, that were factors that influenced. And uh, I think in the main we set out to go about it a certain way and be a bit more, probably a little bit more disciplined than we sometimes are. Um, and I think in the main, in the main we, we managed to carry it out and, uh, and through. So, so I was pleased in a defensive led very uh, defensively solid performance. Uh, we didn't allow them to create many clear cut chances, did we? No, we didn't. To be honest, yeah, Cameron's made one very good save in the first half, and uh, the way they just opened it up a little bit. Uh, but, but outside of that, he's not he actually hasn't made a save. Um, in saying that, their keepers not really had loads to do either. So it's been a very much a bit of a, a, a scrap in midfield, and both both sides have competed really well. So it's been very even throughout the game, so there wasn't a lot in it at all. A number, a number of players were missing today, Adam and Morgan and Paul Marshall, just to name a couple. Uh, have you got any updates on those players? Well, Paul Marshall's got a virus, so he's not, he's not been very well since he's not, not, he's not fit, even though he's, he's, his foot problems set, seems to be settling down. Um, Danny Morton, another one, the hamstring injury, he's, he's getting better. He's probably two, two to three weeks away, I'd, I'd guess. Um, who was the other one? Who was the, uh, yeah, Adam Morgan. Adam Morgan, yeah, Adam, Adam is just a, just a little bit of a precautionary thing. It's not a major problem at all. He's just had a little bit of a niggle. Uh, we just decided just to, to pull him out of the game, really, just to make sure we looked after him. And uh, So there's no issue, major problem there with him. Um, he'll be back shortly. And Southport on Tuesday. Uh, it's going to be another tough game, I imagine, despite uh, what the standings may suggest. Well, we know we played them a few weeks ago, didn't we? And they beat us, and uh, so we, we know this division is very, very hard to predict. Every week, you don't know who's going to beat who. Uh, there is a bit of a guide. Obviously, the teams that are at the top generally are winning more, but they're not winning, winning it by many. There's not been many runaway games, and uh, so uh, I think in the instance with um, Southport, I think they've been beaten again today, and they're, they're, they're finding it hard. There's a few players left there recently, so these, these things going on in the background and it's going to be a bit of unsettled. We've really got to try and take advantage of that while they're on a bit of a low. Um, we've got to try and go there and, and win and not, you know, we're not going to draw, we're going to go and try and win. And um, I don't know why we can't, you know, it's, it's really about us and having a, the belief and confidence to get our foot on it. It's a good pitch, it's a big pitch and uh, if we defend well, like we've done today and we've, like we have done for the last few weeks, no reason why we can't go there and, and get something.